Hello everyone and welcome to my first FIFA 14 Ultimate Team web app trading video. This one is just going to be depicting a few of my trades that I have done in the past, you know, I spent out an hour and um, I'm going to show you over like the course of like three hours what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, hopefully you can get some insight onto what I'm doing. Of course on my channel I've uploaded a load of trading tips and there will also be a one today of the one method I am doing right now. So with this method um, at the moment, what I'm doing right now is I'm just selling my golds, all the golds that I'm not interested in. So as you can see, even Huddleston, even though he is from the BPL, he will eventually selling. He doesn't go for that much anyway because he's very, very poor. Um, so yeah, on to my trades now anyway. So this Makeda I did pick up for, I think, 300 coins. I can have a look on my thingy actually. On here, I picked him up for 400 coins. Trying to sell him for 950. I can even lower him to like 600 coins though. I don't think he'll go any lower than that and hopefully he can sell him for that. Um, as you can see, I bought this Landjurak here for 300 coins. We'll take a look at him in the transfer list and he is looking like this at the moment. So he's going to be selling hopefully for 950 coins. He is a Borussia Dortmund and silver goalkeeper so of course it's going to be worth quite a bit because Borussia Dortmund are very popular. Now these two I did just pick up right now. Now this guy was pretty good. 600 coins for the Inter Milan um, silver rare goalkeeper. If you look at his stats, all um, four stats over 70, so pretty nice stats there. Hopefully um, nobody puts it lower than like 1.5k and I can get a nice profit of that out of him. I'll check him on the market in a second. And also this guy, best buy yet, I believe 200 coins for a Real Madrid Spanish centre-back, 71 pace and 72 defending. So take a look on the market right now. We're going to take a little look at their prices. Um, and I absolutely love this web app. It's really, really fast and responsive, which is exactly what the other web app wasn't. So this is really, really nice. Of course, I'll leave a link to it in the description if you didn't know it was out. So we have two on the market. As you can see, one there for 500 coins. I'm actually going to pick that up as well because I think that is another good buy. So as you can see right there, I picked up two. I'm going to sell. I'm going to try and sell both of these. One for 1.4 and one for 1.5. Um, actually, one for 1.3, other one for 1.4. So this one, um, I do. I just think this is a good buy. Hopefully, anyway. Uh, so 1.3 there, and this one is going to go for and one point. I'll do one point two actually. I won't. I just want. I want people to sell, getting a nice bit of profit, but don't want to, uh, you know, overstretch myself. Now the goalkeeper from Inter Milan. Let's take a look on the market. This is of course like an hour or two after the webbots release, so um, prices are just massively going crazy right now. And um, yeah, it's difficult to trade. I'm struggling a little bit, but it's only been like ten minutes, and I've found a few deals. So hopefully these guys can sell. I think I've had one deal sell as well so far. I'm not too sure. Um, what was it? Inter's goalkeeper. So I'm not too sure if this guy will be anywhere around. So is that okay? So all right then. Um, I'm gonna send into my watch list this guy. Add transfer targets. That's what it's called now. The watch list is now transfer targets, as well as the trade pile being transfer list. Um, that guy I'm not too bothered about. However, this um, the one I bought. I bought for 600 coins, I believe. I'm gonna try and sell him for 1,400 coins on a buy now. So hopefully he can maybe sell for that. And yeah, I'll see you in a you know in a second when I've got some more trades going on. Yo guys, so I just went and did the simplest method possible right now. I just have to like five minutes trying to search for some more players. I just went and did the th uh, discard method. So for these players, all bought for 300 coins, and I can discard them for like 50 coin profit on all of them. So that one is an eight coin profit, and this one is also an eight coin profit. And this one is also an 8 coin profit. You know, eventually these guys could possibly sell for 400 if you wanted to do that. Um, but I'm not too bothered about it right now. As you can see, my coins are eventually stacking up and stacking up. And we're going to discard one more player. And now we're sat on 2,000 coins. Also, I put some other silvers on the market from my club, um, including, uh, I think, these three. And I'm going to be putting these up on the market in a second. Um, for, for my method at the moment, I'm kind of just trying to search through some silvers, um, just like this in the back of Premier League, see if any uh, rares pop up just like that however I do have a few more coins to spend now so what I'm trying to do at the moment I'm just gonna show this method really quickly um, looking for specific clubs like Arsenal if they have any cheap players on the go uh, but at the moment no one has really many coins to spend so no one's really looking for these players but in like a day's time people have a few coins built up and be looking to maybe buy some cheap silvers like this and and yeah, just generally plays like this could be quite good. However, gold I think is where it might be at. So I'm going to move on to gold for my next method or my next kind of trade, hopefully. So I'll see you in a second. Okay, then, guys, I just made my first trade that I might actually be able to sell. Yay! Um, this one cost 2,000 coins and it was a buy now machete. And as you can see on the market, there isn't many up and it's the lowest one is 3,000 coins. So I'm going to put mine up for um, the, oh, what's it called? 2,900 buy now. And hopefully you can sell for that. That'll be a nice, um, I think, 750 coins of profit. So that'll, that's pretty Really nice profit at this stage, at least for the amount of coins I have. Um, we're just going to refresh the market again, just to see if there's anything else on there. 
And no, there isn't. So I'm going to do the discard method like a little bit since I've got 680 coins left. And I'll see you in a minute. All right, then, guys. So finally, Marchetti has sold after about an hour and a half on the market. He did sell for 2,900 coins. So that was about a 750 coin profit. Very happy with that. And also, Macheda or Macheda sold for 850 coins. I believe we picked him up for like 350. So he did um, bring us in some nice profit as well. I have bought a few other players as well on the market. Um, some French rare silvers. And also, this guy was in the French league as well. So, uh, I think I bought him for like 250 coins. Him for like 300, uh, him for 250, and also him for 250. And um, these guys will hopefully eventually sell. I'm just trying to trade in various areas. Um, I can't really show you anything specific right now. But um, at the moment, I'm just looking for some gold BPLs and also some silver BPLs. So hopefully, I can pick some of them up cheap. Okay then guys, I just went to pick up two more silvers, and this one is a Ragatsu. Now this guy's fairly fast, as you can see, he actually has 89 pace. He's in the Serie A League, and I'm going to list him for, I think, 1,300 coins on a buy now. I picked him up for 700 coins, so that isn't too bad. I'm also just going to check Sestu's price right now. So, take a look on the market. He is a centre forward, um, Italian for which club I need to little take a look at. Um, and it is Chievo Viore, I think it is. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Nearly got it right. Um, and he does go for like a thousand coins, I think. Yep. So I'm going to put mine up for 950, and hopefully he's going to sell for that price. It'll be the cheapest on the market at that time. And I did pick him up for 450 coins, so that's a good little buy there. Hopefully these guys are going to sell fast. Also, on my transfer list, um, one of the centre back um, Real Madrid players did sell for 950 coins. And remember, I was picking them up for like 300 and 500 coins. So hopefully this one can sell soon. Even though he's on a less price, he isn't um, looking to sell any time soon um, also I'm looking to pick up all these silvers and gold so hopefully we can do that I'll see you in a minute Okay guys, so the last two buys of this episode of like foot trading kind of thing on the web app, um, I picked up two Pisanos, one for I think 1900 coins and the other for 2200 coins and I'm going to try and sell the, both of these for 2800 coins and 2700 coins. So I'm going to put them up now on the market. Um, this one I'm going to put up for 2800 and the other one I'm going to put up for the 2700. So hopefully those guys can sell. I mean it's not too much profit on any of these players but I don't have many coins to spend right now. I didn't get the best starting packs unfortunately but it doesn't matter. As you can see I've got loads of silver selling. I have 1.3k to spend. I'm going to probably spend them on gold players, maybe. I'm not too sure. Um, as you can see, another Pisano there selling for pretty cheap. So hopefully, I can pick up somebody cheap. Um, anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you could leave a like on this episode, and that would be awesome. Get up to 500, legendary. Um, and of course, do subscribe if you're new around here. Uh, loads of training tips around on my channel. Another one hopefully out today, as I said. And yeah, I'll see you all guys then. Bye-bye. <laughs>